Hey, it's Kyle here, and today I'll be reviewing Nightfall and other stories by Isaac Asimov. If you're not familiar with Isaac Asimov, he's um, by many people claimed to be the um, the most accomplished and most influential sci-fi writer of all time. A lot of stuff we take for granted in sci-fi now was actually developed by Asimov. So, for example, like the Three Laws of Robotics. Um, that was Asimov's creation. So even other sci-fi writers and books, TV shows, movies kind of honor these concepts that Asimov developed. Um, um, probably the thing I'm a biggest fan of his is the Foundation series, which is his very acclaimed series. It's amazing. Um, love that series so much. Um, but I've never really read any short stories by Asimov before, and I've heard uh, a few people recommend this series, and I've also heard of Nightfall, which is the short story that this collection is named after, and, and many people um, proclaim Nightfall as like the greatest sci-fi short story of all time. Um, so I was very interested and intrigued to read this collection of short stories, and I am really glad I did. Uh, so a couple of things I really enjoyed about the collection beyond um, beyond the stories themselves, which were amazing, is before each story, this, well, first I say this collection was actually put together by Isaac, Isaac Asimov himself. So he put the stories in here that he, he wanted to be a part of this collection. He made a point, like, he felt like these were some ones maybe uh, that had been overlooked or he wanted to give better context to, so he kind of, you know, curated his own collection. And before each story, he kind of writes um, a page or two kind of explaining the origin of the story, what was going on, sometimes what was going on in his personal life, um, what was going on in his professional life, what inspired the story. So it's a very interesting look of what inspired these very cool, interesting stories that like a lot of times in um, short story collections you don't get because it's a different editor that's putting the, together the collection, not the author itself. And um, he also organized it by the order that they were written and published. So you... As you said, you're kind of seeing how his writing style and thoughts and um, theories develop over the course of his writing career. Um, so I really enjoyed um, that aspect of it. So I'd say, one, if you're a big fan of Asimov and you've read his short stories before but you've never read this collection, I would say getting this collection is worth it just for those insights that Asimov offers before each of his stories. Um, Nightfall is the first story featured in this collection, and I definitely have to read it and see why some people think it is the best sci-fi story of all time. It is very creative, very interesting, um, and a very short of my time, it makes you care about the stories and the situation, uh, sorry, the characters in the situation. Uh, kind of give you an idea a little bit what Nightfall is uh, based on, is this planet is um, um, orbited by, or this planet orbits several suns, so it's basically constantly in daylight. There's never nighttime. Um, but these group of scientists have came across this theory that once every 2,000 years or so, um, the sky goes dark and um, night descends on this planet and it causes chaos and stuff like this. And so the short stories follows these scientists and a reporter as they try to figure out is this true or not and what impact this has on the planet. It is a very interesting story. And um, there is a total of uh, probably, I don't know, 20, 25 stories in here. Let me get to the... Uh, the little listing here, sorry, I should have counted these up for one, two, three, four. yeah, about, I'd say 15 or 20. A couple others are my favorites. I really enjoyed uh, Green Patches, was very cool. Uh, what If uh, was a kind of fun um, rom-com sci-fi fantasy story. It was really cool. Um, it's such a beautiful day. I really enjoyed it a lot. Um, what is this thing called love? Oh, that was really cool. The Machine That Won the War was a very interesting and dark story. Um, Eyes Do More Than See was another one that um, was very interesting. And honestly, there wasn't really any stories in here that I read that's like, oh, this story's awful. They were all very cool. So I would say if you really enjoy uh, sci-fi, um, and maybe you've never really read any short stories, this is a really cool collection to start with. If you're a fan of Asimov, I would definitely recommend this, especially if you've never... Um, um, Red Nightfall. This was definitely a big hole in my Asimov fandom, and I'm glad I, I kind of filled it. So I would certainly recommend Nightfall and other stories by Isaac Asimov. Uh, let me know in the comment section below who is your favorite sci-fi author of all time, and what is your favorite work of theirs. Um, it's interesting to see what everybody kind of pegs as their favorites. 
Uh, but anyway, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this review. If you did, hit the like button. If you have yet, please subscribe to the channel. I really appreciate the support. Thanks for watching. I'll see you the next time, and happy reading.